We are in the land of Mezzani. I'm the counsellor. Are you a friend? Help! Let your burdens go. Wait, no, Chris, it's a trick. Listen, you really have to let them go. I, whatever you heard from old Nicola, nobody gets through the swamp of despondency with those burdens on their backs. He wants us to go down to a, a town called Doubt so that we can get some advice from a jester. Halt, who goes there? Uh, we're just travellers. We're on our way to Doubt. Well, you can't come this way, Sonny. This way's been blocked off. Why? Because I said so, Sonny. Move along now. But this is the way to doubt. We need to get there. We need to meet somebody called Arfast. He can teach us more about the word. And he can help us get out of the Isle of Fear. Well, that's your problem, Sonny, not mine. Mine is to guard this road. But why are you guarding it? It's my job. I'm a guard. I've been told to guard this road. Ipso facto, I am guarding this road. Now... Can you all move along, please? But there must be a reason. Yeah, otherwise we're just blocking off a road for no reason. Well, there is a reason, but that's for the brass to work out, not for the likes of me. The brass? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. We are a pair of little civvies, aren't we? The brass is the, uh, uh, the commanders, the officers, those in charge. You really don't know anything, do you? You don't even know why you're blocking off this road. Can we talk to the brass? I don't see why not, but I don't see why either, so no. Now, move on with you, I've got a lot of guarding to do. As you were, private pedant. So... Now then, now then, let's go and discuss this in my tent. You're the brass? I was the last time I checked, yes. Anyway, I know that Private Pedant has been giving you a lot of trouble, but uh, I'm afraid he is correct. This whole area is enemy territory now, I'm afraid. What enemy? The only enemy worth talking about. Error. Uh, error? Yes, error. Terrifying enemy it is as well. I got ambushed by error not long ago. Um, platoon taken completely unawares. Lost three soldiers. What happened? They bought it. You mean they... Yes, they bought it. Completely fell for it, hook, line and sinker. Really nasty one too as well, about the City of Light not being a real place and it being a metaphor for inner contentment or something such. But they come in all shapes and sizes. Anyway, nowadays I avoid all contact with the forces of error. But how do you defeat them if you don't fight them. Come with me, you young rapscallion, and I'll show you. Now, Private Pedant is engaging the enemy in a way that ensures that his mind will not be changed at all. He can't be influenced one bit. Wait, doesn't that mean he won't have any influence either? I suppose not, but that's not the point. This is a safety first. Anyway, um... It still involves an awful lot of stress. I mean, it's infuriating dealing with error, even from a distance. Urgh. Hang in there, Private. Thank you, sir. So, as you can see, there's just no way I can allow you to keep going down this track. It's much too risky. But surely there are risks. Yeah, we're not in your army. Surely we should be able to decide how much risk we take for ourselves. Well, I suppose so. Well, good luck, you young whippersnappers. If I find you've been taken over by an enormous error, I shall be sure to write about it most angrily on the internet. Thank you, sir. Big they didn't have much confidence, did they? No. <laughs> What was that? I'm not sure. 